Hello, all of my yawns out there. It's Sinu here, back with Resident Evil 4. And I actually don't have a lot of experience with the Resident Evil games, as big as they are in horror games. I've played, like, a tiny bit of the beginning of this one a long time ago, like, probably at least five years ago. I don't know how Resident long it's been. Evil 2005. Okay, so yeah, that means this game's like 10 years old. So it's been a long time since I messed with this. Let's see the intro. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. I've never Soon seen after, this. The news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. With the whole affair gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Yeah, when I played it in the past, I never really saw any of the story or Six anything. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. Whoa. It's been a long time. Copyright infringement. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Cornia. Why am I the one who always gets the short end of the stick? The yeah. short end of the stick? Who are you, really? Come on and tell us. It's not racist because I'm Hispanic. You are a long I don't think that actually cowboy. works, though. You have my sympathies. I just like Is accents. Is this the local's way of breaking the ice? Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could I mean, sing yeah. Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Then again, maybe you did. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. Oh, you crazy American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. Wait, where are we? Did it say where we are? Man, I'm good at listening. I'm guessing we're not in America since he just called me an American. Really hard to find a game breaking glitch. It was right oh, before I was to take is that a challenge? Of protecting the president's daughter when she was abducted. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. Rural Spain. According to our intelligence, yeah. there's reliable information about a sighting of a girl that looks very similar to the president's daughter. The president's Apparently daughter. She's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. I would have thought that my first job would have been a rescue mission. Alicia. So it seems like it's cold there. It's freezing. Whoa. Okay, look at that. I'm like a fortune teller. Or a meteorologist. Uh, Pretty much the same thing, right? Sorry it took so long. Yeah, I don't really know much about the story. So this will be pretty interesting actually getting to play through it, experience the story. I've always heard such good things, especially like a lot of people I know that have played Resident Evil. I have more experience with this one than the earlier ones. Just up ahead is the village. So this is the one I've heard the most I'll often have a look recommended. Yeah, we'll stay and watch that car. Oh, nice. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Oh, yeah. Right. Hmm. Parking tickets. Good luck. Jeez, dude. Are they just like really scared? So they're like, <laughs> we're gonna sit in the car. You go take care of these guys. Yeah, I mean, come Did on. Did you say something? Yeah. Leon, I hope you can hear me. I can hear I'm you. I'm David Hunnigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. 
Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. So the subject's Are name's Ashley her? Graham, right? That's right. She's the daughter Ashley of Graham. the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Be on out. out. I should check out the file. How do I check out the file? I found out how to check out the... Oh, I remember this inventory system. You actually, like, place them based on their shapes. I remember someone talking to me about that. Alright, files. Let's see, communication log, playing manual one, info on Ashley. Uh, age 20, a daughter of the United States president. She was kidnapped by an unidentified group while on her way home from her university. The kidnapper's motives are still unknown, although there is reliable information that the perpetrator is an insider. Only a handful of people know about this kidnapping. It's been kept under wraps mostly due to the fact that we can't determine who the traitor is. The guys in intelligence say they have reliable information that Ashley has been sighted somewhere in Europe. But until we find out who the insider is, I don't know what to believe. It could be a ploy. We have very few leads as to the whereabouts of Ashley, but members of the Secret Service and anyone else related to Ashley are being questioned by an investigative team. Even active agents are being investigated for any information. It's just a matter of time before the kidnapper is exposed. Alright, cool. Uh, I don't think I need to look at any other files. We're good there. Uh, weapons recovery. I don't even know what that's about. Alright, uh, key treasures. Alright, so weapons recovery is my items. Like, weapons and recovery items, that sort of thing. Key treasures, key items. Pretty standard stuff. So, the control scheme is gonna take a little bit of getting used to, probably. But I don't think it's too bad. I turn left and right with, I think I remember something about shooting birds being good. Yep, okay. Awesome. Already remembering good things from the past. Alright, so what did we get to take? You got 400 petas. You got this spinel. What the heck? Was that like a gem? Do I sell that for money? I don't know. Blood diamonds. Wait, check. The guidepost reads Pueblo. Huh. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna head that way then. Is it a zombie? Alright, does this game, like, trash all of the ammo left in your gun when you reload? I hate when games do that. I'll have to try to keep my eye on things and be aware of it. Is there a zombie in here? I do not want to get... Huh! Nope. Dude! I will shoot you before you can even say hello. Actually, I won't, because that would be kind of a jerk move. There are various small items on the shelf. Nothing particularly unusual here. Alright. This control scheme is definitely going to take some getting used to. So my precious gemstone, okay. Uh, excuse me. Sir? He can't talk to you, dude. He's a z that, that doesn't seem like a zombie. Why would a zombie be poking at fire? I don't think it's a zombie. I was wondering if Wait, you might recognize a girl in this photograph. ¿Qué carajo estás haciendo aquí? Lárgate, cabrón! Oh, Sorry, he doesn't like me. It. The zombies in this game are different from- Whoa! The types of zombies we're used to, right? Freeze. I think I remember that they're like all different. Is it freeze? Like actually people or something. No worries, I got this. Are they leaving me? Or are they like coming to check things out? Oh wait, no, that's someone else. And there's totally a guy coming in to come and kill me. Good thing we were able to look at Leon's eyes instead of what he was looking at. All we got to do is hear the sound of the car trying to get away. Are they alive? Is everything okay? There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. That there means still others him. surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. All right. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. That means kill Understood. everyone. Understood. Huh? Run! Turn! Gun!
Watch, they're gonna be like upstairs. They're gonna get sneak attacked. Where the heck are they? Oh my god, dude. Alright, this is a bad idea probably. But the heck? Is the door like sealed? Alright. He's not a zombie. So it's basically telling me right now that I killed a townsperson that isn't a zombie. That's nice. Looks like they've killed a lot of people. Oh, hmm. I guess it's not that bad then. I hope Ashley's okay. That's disgusting. There's like a bunch of maggots and stuff crawling around in there. Alright. Uh, hey, look, ammo. Right? Handgun ammo. Nice. Alright. Let's go ahead and uh, head downstairs. I'm guessing we have to head out the front door then. Uh, I turn really slow. Something rotten is caked on the table. It seems like someone was eating here until just recently. They were eating on a table that's got rotten stuff. That's nasty. Alright, so... Are we gonna open this and be fighting some people? It won't budge! They must be pressing against it from the other side. So should I, like, jump out the window then? Jump out. Nice! What a beast. Alright, so I'm guessing I should be shooting these guys now. Ooh, that was close. That was really close. Alright, uh, I think I need to... I just pressed R and it didn't reload. Mm. Da 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 da. Nice. You just killed a bunch of townspeople. Alright, let's break this open. Check. It's a wooden box. Looks like it can be broken. Alright, so I press space for my knife. Okay, there we go. Nice. I don't think it had anything in it. Man, I'm lucky. Alright, how do I reload? R doesn't reload. Oh, okay, I have to be, like, zoomed in when I do it. Okay, got it. Alright, what's this? Betas, nice. I don't know if that's actually how you say it or anything, but I'm not gonna worry about it. Alright, that guy didn't have anything for me. Let's head out. Uh, so, is this car over here gone? Guys? Ooh, that doesn't look good. And the bridge is out. Nice. Exactly what we wanted to happen. Look down. Ooh. Did they drive straight into the car and knock them off the cliff? Are you serious? No. They're crazy. Dude, what the heck? This is like worse than zombies. These are insane town people who are able to think. Oh, that's one of the birds I shot. There's the other one. Maybe the townspeople really love their birds, and they're just really mad because I killed them. They're like, dang it, man, I named them and everything. You had to go and kill them for no reason. Cold-hearted American. Alright, let me shoot the bird over here. Nice. Let me kill that one, too. Nice. Got some items we're gonna go pick up. Already doing good. Already doing good. Alright, let's cut these. Nice. 1,000 petas. It's a wooden box. So looks like it's gonna be broken. Take the green herb. Yes, I think so. Take the handgun ammo. Save. Yes, this is what I'm talking about. Alright, let's save. Save data. Yes. Saving content. So does that mean we have 20 separate save slots? That's nice. So if I have problems, I can always go back. Your internet was down for a while. I'm sorry. It's glad. Uh, I'm glad that it's back up now. Hopefully, I don't have any internet problems while we're doing this. In case anyone's wondering who I'm talking to, 200 betas. Uh, in case anyone's wondering who I'm talking to, we've got the stream that's going on right now while I record. Ooh. Oh. I'm gonna free you, even though you'll probably just kill me. This is one of those Wolf Among Us QQQQQ moments. Are you gonna turn on me? You... Dang, dude. I wish I could jump like that when I get my leg, like, stuck in a... <laughs> okay, no, it's just the flappy thing. Uh, when I get my leg stuck in bear trap? There's another bear trap right there. I need to watch out for them. I don't want to get my legs stuck in a bear trap. 
I don't even think I can jump normally. Wolf over here should be in the Olympics. What a, is that a, like a tripwire explosive? Oh my god. These townspeople are insane. They're literally just blatantly trying to kill anyone who comes through here. I'm gonna run to a bear trap, or yeah, a bear trap while I'm, okay, we're good, we're good. Where? I hate you. I shoot him in the mouth and he's just like, oh, my tooth hurts. And he's like, I don't care. I'm gonna come kill you now. What are you buying? What are you selling? It's funny because I haven't played through the entire game, but I know some of the uh, jokes from the game. Like that uh, shopkeeper. I'm pretty sure this is the game that has that shopkeeper. And... Yeah. I want to say this is that game. Alright, is there anyone in here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Get out, get out. Is that a dead body up on that wall? Oh my god. Where the hell is the screaming person? Dude? Oh, found him. There's multiple. Oh, he moved like right when I shot. Alright. Too bad it's not one headshot kills them, but I'm not complaining. This works too. Alright, reload. So far things are looking pretty good with how I'm able to uh, deal with these people. Got quite a bit of extra ammo. Racking it up. Alright, let's break this box. Take this uh, 3,300 betas. That's like the most I've found at once, I think, so far. A green herb. I'm guessing at some point soon I'm gonna have to look in my inventory and adjust the order of things to get everything to fit. Man, that is brutal. Jeez. Ugh, her face looks so messed up. Alright, so... We're gonna keep on moving. These guys didn't drop anything. Have to be careful not to run into bear traps, but so far I don't think any bear traps have been, like, in the middle of the road. I think they're all off the road. Alright, let's head this way. Oh, there's quite a few people up there. It's like, hey bro, get off your fat butt and come over here so we can beat this guy up. I'm just over here like, really, guys, you don't have to do so much for me. Honestly, I don't need a welcome party. Go back to your homes. Are they, like, coming down here, or... Are they gonna start throwing things at me from up there? I don't even know. I'm about to walk into a trap. This isn't gonna end well. Is there a guy in there? Yeah, I can see a guy in there. Man, trying to sneak attack me and stuff. Dang it, the first one wasn't a headshot. Nice, okay. So far, everyone's been two shot headshot or two headshots to kill. I'm wondering if that's just gonna be a consistent thing. Oh yeah, I have a shotgun on me, don't I? Dang, I have so much handgun ammo. Does that stuff stack? Oh wow, yeah, it really stacks. That's awesome. All right, things are looking good. Oh, what am I doing? Okay, here we go. That's what I get for looking at chat. I'm sorry. Alright, before we go through here, we're gonna stop the video. We're just about at 20 minutes. So, thank you very much for checking out this first episode of Resident Evil 4. I'm looking forward to playing through this game. I hope that you stick around for a while, enjoy the videos. Have a wonderful day, all of my yawns out there. And don't forget to feed your pets.